Hello everyone, I am Pratip Thick Bites and the project I have created here is called iSmart. iSmart is a specially designed smart home for the visually impaired people. It consists of three micro bits which communicate with each other using radio instead of Wi-Fi. These micro bits are powered by battery and USB and in the future they can be powered using solar energy as well. So these micro bits are connected to servos, motor fans, motion detectors and smoke detectors. So this is a model of the house. This is the main door. This is the main door micro bit. This is the living room. This is the bedroom. And this is the study room. So once the resident is at the main door, he or she has to enter the password. So the password in this case is A B A A B B A and then we hit the microbit logo and then the door opens automatically. So this is the functionality of the servo and then 7 seconds later the door closes automatically. So it closes at 7 seconds to allow enough time for the door to open and the resident to enter and the door to close after it. So the project would normally consist of 3 micro bits but for demonstration purposes I am showing only one. So the second, there will be one micro bit in the bedroom and one micro bit in the study room. The micro bit in the bedroom and the study room will be equipped with motion detectors, smoke detectors, servos and motor fans. So when the motion detector at, be at the bedroom detects the resident entry the bedroom, it will turn on the motor fan and open the door automatically for, for the resident. What's, mo what's more, for additional safety, these two micro bits are equipped with smoke detectors. So once these smoke detectors detect smoke, it will buzz a very audible alarm to alert the resident so that he or she can run out of the door for safety. So now let's talk about the external safety features. Now let's see what intruder tries to enter the home. He or she will have to enter the password, so that intruder obviously doesn't know the password. So he or she will enter a password like A, B, A, B, and then he, the intruder will hit the microbit logo. The door will not open. So that's an external safety feature. And if, and if the resident wants to lock the door from the outside, he or she has to press buttons A and B together that locks the door. So in the future, I plan to enhance this by adding a robot inside the house which also uses a micro bit to assist the resident while he's at home. I also plan to make a st stronger password and to charge all these micro bits using solar energy. So this is the code for the main door micro bit. So as you can see, this is the code here. This is the code for the micro bit of room 1. And this is the code for the microbit in room 2. Thank you for your time.